This is Tiana. She's 18 years old. And this is Jesse. He's 19. My parents are helping pay for the wedding, but they have us on a tight budget. I'm thinking a honeymoon right now is realistically not in the picture. And Tiana's sister is driving her crazy. I'm going to kick the all you guys. Stupid. Our wedding is just six weeks away. <laughs> I think it's horrific. So who wants to go swimming? We need all the help we can get. People, People think, think we're too young, young to get, get married, married, but we, we don't, don't care. care. This is supposed to be my Jane. She's being a little and ruining it. And just kind of let your foot off the brake, and you'll just feel how everything goes. I know. And... Jesse's taking me on a driving lesson. This is my first time behind the wheel. For all the things we have to do for the wedding, Jesse has to drive me everywhere, and he's starting to get sick of it. Stay in between us. It does get irritating. I always have to think about where she has to go. I do hate your car. Your gas sucks. I've driven worse. I've never. I met Tiana when I was 15. We were in a foods class together, and I thought she was really hot. He was mean to me, but it's because he liked me. <laughs> go out there, and then we'll try to reverse. Reverse? I can't yep. even go forward yet. I proposed. It was all snowy and cold and wet, so. It wasn't snowy. It was June. Was it? June 20th, you goo. I was in my car, so I got half down on one knee, and. Just like. Yeah, <laughs> kind of like that. <laughs> Asked her, will you marry me? And she said yes. I just think it's the right thing to do. If you really love somebody, you should marry them. It just kind of makes it official. He is my best friend. Love my life. Yeah, it's like touchy. It's like. Hey, holy <laughs> I don't like this. When people say you're way too young to be married, I just let them know age is just a number. Like, you're not a kid. What? <laughs> I quit. <laughs> Take a minute. <laughs> Jess? What's that in the dryer? I don't know, it's like black. Is it your gum? I think so. Jess and I both graduated high school and both have full-time jobs. I'm a customer service representative and Jesse works for his dad installing flooring. Jesse and I own a house and we bought it for $5,000, but it's got $15,000 in repairs to do. Today, Jesse's helped me put together gift bags for my bachelorette party. Does everything have to be about penises? Does everything have to be about strippers on your bachelor party? Yes. <laughs> there you go. I'm super nervous about the dress. You can wear the dress. It'll probably fit you. I ordered my dress online from China. It's way too big. Why wouldn't you just get a size 2 in the first place? Wouldn't that make sense? Yeah, but I don't know, like... If it was like Chinese two or American two. Isn't a two a two? <laughs> we still need a groomsman. Oh yeah, big bold letters. Jesse doesn't have all five groomsmen, so we need to find one more. I had problems finding groomsmen because one of my best friends has crown anxiety and everyone else didn't want the responsibility. They said it was too much work. Cody said no, Andrew said no. Yeah, Cody, Andrew, Kid Nathan, didn't want to be your best man. Yeah, Nathan, time be the best man. I'm a little concerned. I don't know if I can find one in time. What else are we missing? Photographer's booked. Yep, oh, I'm falling over. Decorator, did you talk to her today? Uh, yeah, I talked to Maggie. My mom, my dad, my maid of honor, Amanda, have all come over tonight to discuss wedding plans. Amanda is seven months pregnant, and I'm scared she's going to pop before the wedding. Do you think Jesse and Tyana would have been able to pull this together without any help? I don't think so. Because I've had to remind you guys of <laughs> everything. My mom and I have the best relationship, one that people would die for. I went on Facebook and seen that she was engaged and phoned her and said, are you kidding? And she goes, no. And I said, well, why didn't you tell me? She goes, because I was scared you were going to get mad. I'm like, I would never get mad. You guys are an amazing couple. <laughs> so have you found your last groomsman yet? No, not yet. How many weeks till you get married, Jesse? Mm. What about you? What are you looking forward to? It to be over. So you can save, well, you can save your money and do more rentals to the house. 
I'm looking forward to Jesse's face when he sees Tiana walking down the aisle. Mm -hmm. Our parents are paying for the wedding and Jesse and I are supposed to pay for the honeymoon, but my mom thinks the money should go towards house renovations. When you guys signed the lease to buy the place, they told you that you have timelines. We had till June to fix up our house or we lose our spot on the lot. I'm thinking a honeymoon right now is realistically not in the picture. Well, I think a honeymoon is important for us just because it's nice to get away. And alleviate the stress. I know you guys do want a honeymoon. Of course, yeah. everyone wants one. I don't care what my mom says. We are going on that honeymoon. Mm. So what kind of dress do you want, Mom? Not long. I would like something above my knees. Today we're going shopping for my mom's dress with my maid of honor, Amanda. It's adorable. And my little sister, Nicole. Ooh, even these ones are cute. My little sister, Nicole, who's a monster. She's dating, he is 17 and currently in jail. Do you see him like during the week or? Um, every Sunday. Okay. Or when he comes on a home visit. Are you guys gonna have a big celebration when he's out? Oh yeah. Nice. We're gonna party. Oh, I bet. A year ago, she decided to make some dumb choices and stole a vehicle and got herself in a lot of trouble. Yeah. You grand theft auto? Mm -hmm. 14 yeah. years old. What? You had yeah. to drive when you're 14. I don't know. No. <laughs> She's bad. <laughs> She's a little jealous right now because Tyana is getting a little bit more attention. What do you guys Ooh, think? Oh, I now? like it. Oh, that's oh, really nice. I like it. <laughs> Why? I like the blue one. But I like this one. Well, you're not the bride, so it doesn't matter. This is it. Okay. My biggest concern for the wedding is my little sister is gonna get out of hand. I love it. Wow. So we're going to meet the florist, the decorator, and to talk about the setup and all the arrangements for the wedding. If you're gonna do it, you Gotta do it. Go big or go home. So we're going big, and no one's gonna go home. <laughs> <laughs> I think all the hall and flowers was really nice, but it's not a big deal. I just hope the food's really good when the time comes. Every time I ask him something about the wedding, he's like, I don't care. So, because guys are like, I don't care, I'm hungry. Yep. <laughs> I care about the food. <laughs> Jesse has done very little with the involvement in the wedding. He's done pretty much nothing. He needs to find a groomsman. That's his task. That's all I'm asking him to do. Hey, Mike. It's Jesse from high school. Uh, haven't talked to you in a while. Wondering what's up. Hey, Jordan. It's Jesse calling. I'm just wondering what you're doing on April 21st and if you're free. I need to ask you an important question, so call me back soon. Thanks. Bye. Bye. The crunch is on. Who wants bit. to go swimming? It's not that bad. We're going to the dressmaker to get my dress altered because it's a disaster. I can go swimming in my dress. I don't know why she would order something so much bigger than what she actually is. <laughs> Are you stoked for the wedding? Or? Uh, <laughs> yeah. My maid of honor, she's seven months pregnant and I'm scared she's gonna pop her baby out on the ceremony floor like my goodness. <laughs> I'm not oh, excited oh, yeah. for it being so close to my due date though. I know. <laughs> I'm scared that I'm gonna go into labor when she's like, saying <laughs> her vows, that would suck. Is there anything else you'd like me to adjust at this time? No. Alrighty, then you are all done. Are you sure you wanna see? It cost me $230, but I could've bought three of my dresses for that much. I don't see what's wrong with the length. Of course, Nicole wanted to make a few changes to her dress. Oh, what would you like to have done to your dress? Um, a little bit shorter and like, I don't know, this part like tightened a bit at the bottom. She wants her dress shortened a lot. I don't think it needs to be shortened. Neither do I. Or taken in or anything. You're gonna rip your dress. We finally agreed on the length, but my little sister's still not done. I really want extensions because I hate short hair. Well, your fault for cutting all your hair off. And like my hair's dead and it's thin and I don't like it. Well, I'll babysit your dogs for extensions. Babysit my dogs, they're pretty good on their own. <laughs> I know, but so. No. I agree to lend her my old ones, which are black. No complaining about them and no temper tantrums that they don't look good. Okay. I'm very worried that she's gonna get ticked off the day of the wedding because her hair isn't good enough and she's gonna storm out. And then what do we do? 
If you could walk me through the, the wedding party. I'm going to meet my best man and my father-in-law for tuxedo fittings. I'm still missing one groomsman. Okay. And then there's another one who can't make it today. He's going to come tomorrow. Yeah. One of my groomsmen is actually my dad because I was having trouble finding people. You got to be a little friendly here with you for a second. Well, my relationship with Jesse is phenomenal. When my dad found out that we were engaged, he was excited, but kind of shocked. I actually asked him, you know, what's the rush? 19 is young. You got yeah. lots of years ahead of you. Every time you go out, you'll fall in love with a different girl when you're single. And then you go to the stripper bar and you fall in love with them. You're all set? Yep. I wonder what the financial advisor is going to say. Today we're meeting a financial planner. We have to pay for the repairs on the house in three months or we're evicted. We would also like to afford a honeymoon. I don't have anything ready for her or any numbers in my head, so. Yeah, me neither. We're going to look like idiots. Um... Make ourselves comfortable. We were going to talk to you about the house renovations and how to save up for that. And we also want to go on a honeymoon. And my mom doesn't want us going because of the house renovations. We bought our house four months ago, and it needs lots of work. We are going to do new windows, new siding, okay. new insulation, um, new roof. So basically, you're rebuilding the thing. It's got $15,000 in repairs to do. So when do you want to start those? They have to be done by this. They have to be done, done by, by June. June. So you need to come up with 15 grand in three months. <laughs> yeah. Yes. How are you going to do that? Daddy. Cut all expenses <laughs> as much as possible. Yeah. So. so you plan to stop eating for three months? Well, we don't have to buy like the luxury kind of items. Jesse likes buying candy. I like with... to buy a lot of candy. Oh, honey. <laughs> In 10 years, I see myself in a bigger house, a nice car, and kids. Based on the numbers that we have, you have to be saving $12,000 a month. So do you have any savings at all? About 50 bucks. I'm sorry to have to be the one to tell you this, but you're not getting the rentals done, and you're sure as heck not going to Jamaica. It's pretty straightforward there. We're screwed. You're not doomed for life. I feel that way. I feel like I'm going to be poor and living in a box. <laughs> it's great that you have goals, and, and that's yeah. really, that is awesome. But you have no way to make them happen. So they're not goals. These are fantasies. And I don't know how many people have given you a hard time about the fact that you're 18 and getting married. Nobody. None. Really, eh? Because, really? like, to me, that's pretty young. We're not going on a honeymoon. Yeah, I don't think we can afford a honeymoon. My mother was right. It was a very big wake-up call coming here. We just need each other. Just need each other. We just need a really big box. <laughs> Tonight is the night of our bachelor and bachelorette parties. Did you find a groomsman? No, not yet. Hmm. So I found you one. Who? Dustin. Yeah? Awesome. Awesome! <laughs> Tiana's mom saves the day. Dustin is the son of her best friend. Do not take shots. Oh, Mix? come on. He has power to have, drink. He has to have a couple Kay. shooters. No mixing, please. Nope. So I can only do whiskey uh, shots then. Yes, yeah. you're going to sleep in the bathtub if you get sick. <laughs> the girls took me to a hotel for my bachelorette party. We're swimming and having a few drinks. There you go. Now try and get rid of that. You're doing all night. <laughs> <laughs> my boys came over for some warm up drinks. OK, boys, grab one. To Jesse. To me. Last night of singleness. <laughs> Hello. Then we hit the party bus and went clubbing. Right with the stripper. There's a stripper pole. You guys have to open your gifts. I got you guys. Better. Yeah. yeah. I know what I'm doing tonight. Hold on. Oh, yeah. Maximum pleasure. Uh, Very nice. That's so much penises. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Jay. <laughs> Just <laughs> again, oh, my wife. I'm a little concerned about my little sister and the alcohol. Well, I'm a teenager. What do you expect? I'm obviously going to drink. Nicole can be a crazy drunk. She saw a cute boy in the hallway. Now she wants to go look for him. Uh, can we do go down the halls? I'm not going down the halls in that thing. Why? I don't want to. If you want to go there, do it yourself. No, I'm not doing it myself. That's I'm not going down the hallway with you. F you. I love Nicole. I love Nicole. 
Here's the matter this of the night. This is the boy right the here. The matter of the night. We're going to party and <laughs> and party <laughs> and Yeah. Okay, let's have another round. Okay. Oh, holy, how many shots are we doing? Jesse. What the f*** to me? Yeah. That was good, too. I was hammered. <laughs> you're gonna be a wife and you're gonna have a husband. And you're gonna make babies. He, he's yeah, your first, right? First and only, right? Mm -hmm. Don't you ever wanna experiment? Don't you wanna know what it's like to no. be with somebody else other than him? No. No? Sometimes. You don't You don't think you're gonna feel that way later? Oh, sometimes I do, but then it's like, why? I don't even care, whatever. Sex is sex. Yeah. yeah. When I got on the party bus, my dad was as good as his word. There was a stripper. Yep. No, I haven't seen a stripper before. Let's go with the hot girl man. Yeah, buddy. It was kind of disturbing. Yep. Tiana is by far way sexier than the stripper was. Let's, yeah. just, cutie. Let's just walk the halls and knock on every door until we can find him. Nicole finally convinced us to go track down that cute boy. Let's go, let's go, let's go, go find him. Is my butt still wet? Yep, mine is my butt. We never found Nicole's mysterious cute guy. I think she was seeing things. Hon? Yep? Amanda still hasn't texted me back at all today. I've texted her like 10 times. It's not like her not to text me back. Then why don't you call her? Her phone's just going straight to voicemail. Like, it never does that. Maybe it died? I don't know, maybe. I'll text her mom. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Yeah. Oh my God, Amanda's having her baby. Right now. Right now. She's four weeks early, that's the only thing I'm stressed about. We're gonna go visit Amanda and her daughter at the hospital. Hurry up! Can't run that fast. Amanda can't make it to the wedding. The baby's gonna be in the hospital. The baby's good. She's just not taking to breastfeeding as well. She should be, so she's staying in the NICU. Other than that, they're both doing fantastic. Jesse and I are a little stressed out because we didn't know who's gonna be my new maid of honor. What are we going to do? I don't know. I guess you got to find someone. Who, though? Today's the wedding day, and I'm getting my hair done with my bridesmaids. Tana just texted me uh, the other day while I was at work and asked me to be her new maid of honor. She told me Amanda had her baby. So I'm definitely nervous. I am at my parents' house getting ready to go to the wedding. You need a hand there, chum? Yeah, I do. Hopefully it's going to your shirt. I'm pretty sure they go on a jacket, do they not? Sure. Yeah, sure. That's what I thought. How are you liking your hair, Nick? I love it. Do you? Do you like the extensions now? <laughs> yeah. Looks a lot better than black ones, like you wanted to use mine. I know. OK, ready? Yes. Here we go. How's that we feel? We did it. I'm so excited. I know. I'm not going first. Can you guys like switch spots maybe? No, that's already done and set. Just look at me. Nicole decided she didn't want to walk down the aisle first, so she wasn't being in the wedding anymore. I don't like going first, you know that. So I've I don't done know it. Why ever I don't like when you and you know that, but you're still not changing that. Well, maybe you should not. I, I don't even want to talk to you right, right now. The end of conversation. Game. End of conversation. Thank you. She knows that I don't like going first. Hey, well then I'm out of it. I'm no. not going first. It's okay. No. This it's ruining my day. This is supposed to be about me. You're gonna make me cry. Stop it. I'm gonna Stop walk it. out. This is supposed to be my day, and she's being a little and ruining it. She's not going now. Everybody, take a breath. Everybody, breathe. I've gotta figure it out. You can go second. It's no problem. It's no, it's no problem. It's no problem. It may have looked awkward in the beginning, but we made it all work. And yeah, just Nicole. I just, I, I don't know. It's just who she is, I guess. Just had to make it difficult. Thank you. It's all fabulous. Let's, let's go, folks. Would you please stand? Jesse. Hi, Jesse. Take you, Tiana. Take you, Tiana. To be my wife. To be my wife. I, Tiana. I, Tiana. 
take you, Jesse. Take you, Jesse. To be my husband. To be my husband. You may kiss your bride. I love you. I love you too. I'm very proud of both of them, and I'm very ecstatic that they're together and married and ready to start their life. They've been together for a long time. Ah! <laughs> my dress is going to be ripped and so dirty. In my opinion, it's too oh young God. for me, but for them, maybe it's not. Proud as a peacock, let's see. I won't change anything, except maybe Nicole. I might kick her out. <laughs> Please don't switch in my face. Nice, Be nice, because you have to live with me for the rest of your life. What I love about Jesse is his sense of humor. Every little thing he does, like, I love him for every little and show his body, like. <laughs> I love being with her. She puts me in a good mood, puts a smile on my face. Just great being around her, and I love her. It was amazing. Just, I got to marry the love of my life. Like, there couldn't be anything better. You have handcuffs? Here you go.